Hey, Chris Lipe here with three tips for making singing high way easier. We make it way too difficult. In this video, these tips are really going to help. <laughs> Love it all! <laughs> But you're not going to have full access to the benefits of these tips if you don't have the basics down. If you want to get the basics down with your singing, click the link below and join my free voice course. Once you've gone through those videos, doing these tips is going to be a lot more enriching and powerful for your singing. Tip number one for making singing higher easier. Make your singing more about the rhythm than the pitch. And to do this, start moving your body and start breathing rhythmically. And don't worry about being stupid. I'm stupid all the time and I don't care. I just made up a groove and I'm moving with it. And this and my my breath is acting as kind of a percussion instrument. How is this helping me sing high? Well, when you are moving and when you are moving in rhythm, you can't do it well and in rhythm if you are tense. If you are loose, which moving with the rhythm helps you do, you will have an easier time singing high. If you're focusing on getting pitches or hitting some certain goal, you are not probably moving. In fact, you're probably doing this and tensing up to try to reach that note. So from the onset, when you're practicing, move. Make it about the rhythm in whatever you're trying to sing and internalize that rhythm with your breath and your body. Tip number two, love it all. Don't worry about trying to hit a certain note in a certain way. We tend to tense up and make singing high way more difficult than we need to because we're listening to other vocalists and we have incorrect perceptions about how they're getting to the notes they're getting to. So if you're loose and you're in the moment, practice throwing your voice and just making sound that is not married to hitting a particular note but is going higher, not targeted even to a note, just higher, just like my voice is going higher, like this. Combine that with rhythm. Now, what have I done here? Aside from being very random and making some stupid sounds, I have unlocked freely higher sounds. Yeah, I'm going into head voice. I'm, I'm being very random, but I am loose enough because I'm not trying to achieve that I can utilize these higher areas of my voice. If I was going for a particular pitch, I would seize up. That's tip number two. Love whatever comes out of your mouth as you're experimenting. Yeah. A one, a two. Yeah. Throw your voice so high. And tip number three: check yourself. Record yourself doing these stupid things, and then listen back and hear how you accidentally hit notes that were super high and free. Because I'm not reaching, because I'm freely expressing with no goals in mind and just throwing my voice in different ways, loving whatever comes out of my mouth, I will now go and check what notes I've accidentally hit. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. What's that got? Yeah. That's pretty close. Yeah. C sharp five. That's just the beginning. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. A one, a two. A one, a two. See, I'm, I'm imitating what I did in freedom. A one, a two. G sharp four, G four. 
A one, a two, a ha ha ha! Ooh. <laughs> B4? <laughs> Higher. <laughs> D5? <laughs> Throw your voice so high! So high! Between D5 and D sharp 5. Wow, and that was not me going, I gotta hit that note. This right here is how I learned to sing high by throwing my voice in random ways, being super free and super loose, and then reverse engineering the feel I had when I was free, when I wasn't striving. And then using that sensation, that feeling of freedom, when I start singing real songs. Yeah, it doesn't start out pretty, but it starts out free. And as you square feeling with the joy of singing, as opposed to striving with the struggle of singing, you will be able to freely sing high, and it's not going to be such a big deal. Hope this was helpful. We'll see you for more.